All right, guys, we're going to be solving another question from the second chapter of the Merriam textbook. And in this one, we have this 1800 Newton force F that is applied to the end of the I-beam. And we need to express the force F as a vector using the unit vector I and J. So for finding the unit vector I and J, we basically, if we call this point, point B, and the ending point of the force point A, the unit vector that we are interested in would be the unit vector of NBA which would be basically BA or the vector BA over the magnitude of BA. So now we are dealing with this right triangle in here and moving from point B to A, if we want to find how much we are moving in X direction. So basically we are going from here to here. That side is three units. And since we are going on the negative X axis, that's going to be negative three I. And if we look at the y component we are moving from point b so this will be our y movement which is again negative we are moving four units in the opposite direction of y axis and once we have the numerator the denominator is pretty easy if you have the square root of minus three squared plus minus four squared and we know uh, the denominator would be the square root of nine plus 16 which is 25 so this will be five and our unit vector in here, which is what the question is asking, be each of them divided by 5, so minus 3 over 5i, minus 4 over 5j. And all we need to do in here is just to find x and y component based on this unit vector. So our f in vector form would be the magnitude times the n b a or our unit vector. We know the magnitude of the force is 1800, so 1800 times minus 3 over 5i minus 4 over 5j and we just have to multiply 1800 to each of these so our force f would be 1800 uh, 3 over 5 is 6.6 .6. so times 0.6 that's going to be minus 1080i and we're going to have also 1800 times 4 over 5 is 8 over 10 or 0.8 minus 14 40 j and the unit that we have for the force is newton so that's going to be the final answer for this question hope everything was clear let me know if you guys have any questions and you guys take care i'll see you in the next one